Hi my lovelies, welcome to my channel. My name is Hetty and today I am going to be talking about the importance of being grateful and thankful. So giving thanks isn't just about thanking other people for what they do, it is also about thanking different situations that have happened um, and also thanking yourself as well. It is all about finding the light in dark situations and looking on the bright side of things. So you could call it being an optimist. But giving gratitude and thanks to different things has actually scientifically been proven to increase your long lasting happiness. So how long you stay happy for. It has so many positive benefits and different effects. It can increase uh, the strength of your relationships. It can actually reduce different health challenges that you might be having. It can reduce stress, it can increase your quality of sleep, it can make you more empathetic to situations. So it has a range of amazing benefits, just being grateful. And it isn't difficult to do, you don't have to expend a load of time or energy or effort to do it, you don't have to go out and buy anything to do this. So just giving thanks will improve the quality of your life tenfold if not more. It is all about unconditionality and finding the good in different situations. The more that you are thankful and grateful for different things in your life, the more you actually attract better things into your life as well. So I like to wake up every morning and immediately give thanks for all the wonderful things in my life. So I like to go over in my head all the situations that I am thankful for. So I will say I'm so thankful for my loving, amazing family. I'm so thankful for all my amazing friends and the people in my life who support me unconditionally. Um, I'm so grateful that I have woken up today and that I get to see another amazing day. I am so thankful that, you know, I am able to live in a house with a roof over my head. I'm so thankful for all the food I have to eat well, not have to eat, but I get to eat. Um, I'm so thankful for all these different things. So it can range from anything that you're thankful for. Now, if you're going through a situation at the moment that you think, oh my God, I have nothing to be thankful for. It is literally like, how can you even be sitting here and tell me this? It is literally just, everything just seems so negative. Every single thing in my life, like my relationships, my job, myself, how I feel about my self-confidence. It's all just completely terrible. I've got nothing to be thankful for because why would I be thankful for situations that are not affecting me positively and not doing anything for me? Now, I've been in that place of thinking, why would I be thankful for these negative situations? But you have to find the good in the situations as well. Or if you can't find the good in a particular situation, so if you're working in a difficult job and you cannot find anything that you're grateful about for the job, then try and think about things that you are grateful for. I guarantee you that there is something in that job that you are grateful for. So you might terribly hate the job, but it is giving you money to be able to buy the food that you are eating. There is so many things that even though they look like negative situations, there is a lot of positives that can come out of them. Now, an extreme example that I have used to give thanks for, and some people might find this strange until they understand how it works. Um, but my mom actually passed away when I was very young and for a long time, I just felt honestly terrible about the situation sort of growing up and thinking it's you know unfair why would I ever be thankful that that happened like I'd rather it never happened and that is you know perfectly normal to wish that it never happened to wish that certain situations never happened but I cannot go back and change any of that it has happened it is done there's nothing I can't do anything to you know bring her back into my life at this point so I just give thanks that she was part of my life and that I am where I am now and that you know she's amazing and I've learned so many different things just from her and from the experience of not having a mom in my life growing up so even that you can give thanks for as to where you are just try and find the light in every situation and it can be a little bit difficult I understand I've been there I've been trying to find the light in diff different situations and sometimes it's just a little bit like, okay, come on, I'm really just like clutching at straws here. But if you can't find it in a particular situation, 
focus on other things in your life so focus on the fact that you are able to you know I don't know you're able to go out and have fun with your friends still or you are earning money so that you can put food on your table or provide for your family or you're really thankful that your favourite restaurant has just started doing deliveries and you're really grateful for that so it can literally be from the smallest thing to you know just being grateful for everything in general just being grateful for the lessons things have taught you I say thanks every single morning to everything that has happened in my life and it has brought me to where I am now and that is absolutely amazing because I am happier than I have ever been so if these different things and difficult situations in my past didn't happen I would not be where I am now so I recommend when you wake up every morning it's easiest to do it first thing just go through in your head or you can say out loud you know I am so thankful for x y and z whatever it may be I try and do it before I get out of bed and then my day starts off amazingly because even if I think I've got a really stressful day today at work or you know the weather's terrible outside <laughs> that sometimes brings me down um then I think you know what I'm just so grateful for all these other things and then once I go about my day everything that I maybe have thought about in a negative light before maybe seems so big and like looming and stressful it takes away from any of those negative feelings that you have about situations that you might be going through for your day because you still have so many amazing things and positive things to focus on and be grateful for in your life. I also sometimes do it if I'm going, you know, if I'm getting into particularly negative thoughts, I will just give gratitude and thanks for the good things that are going on. I will just think, I know that's going on at the moment and it's not particularly positive but I actually have so many amazing things to focus on I'm so grateful for that. I do it before bed as well so when I get up and before I go to sleep I just say thank you to you know everything that is in my life that is positive and that has got me to where I am. You don't have to be religious to give thanks. It is in a lot of religions to you know give thanks to um, God or different saints or things like that you don't have to give thanks to a particular thing and thank that one thing for everything if you're religious you can but you can just give thanks to what it is you can just give thanks to that thing and I promise you things in your life will start to improve because you're giving thanks to those things you're starting to see those more uh, a good example is if you are in a relationship and you're going through a particularly difficult time and you're feeling negative you're probably picking out all the things about that person or it might be a friendship you're probably picking out all the negative aspects of that person and focusing on them and thinking oh my god that's just so terrible like why would I be grateful that um, you know then they're, they're really unthoughtful or they're really mean why would I be grateful for that instead think about all of the positives of the situation or that person in particular and think okay it might be diff difficult at the moment and we might be going through a difficult time but I am still so grateful that they're in their they're in my life and you know I'm really grateful that we have so many amazing times together or different things like that and it can really start to strengthen your relationship because instead of picking out all the negatives in that person you are giving the thanks to the good side of things about that person you will start to see your relationship improve tenfold once you stop focusing on the negative aspects of different situations whatever it may be it will attract so many more positive like situations in your life the law of attraction like it says like attracts like so if you are giving thanks for amazing things, if you're giving thanks for the money you currently have, no matter how little or how much it may be, then you will attract more of that into your life because you are thankful for it. It is coming to you more and more and more in abundance. So give thanks, be grateful. Gratitude is proven scientifically. If you don't believe in all of this anyway, then scientifically it has been proven to improve people's lives in amazing ways like I said from relationships to um, reducing stress better sleep and to actually physically healing people who have chronic illnesses or it can help you deal a lot with um, you know long-term pain or different pain situations just to give thanks that you, know, you might not be feeling pain in another part of your body in that kind of way it actually reduces it scientifically so um, I'm saying the word scientifically so much, but um, 
Yeah, it really genuinely does work. It's not just something that people say. It is scientifically proven. So give thanks. They say in the morning, in the night, any point throughout the day, give thanks and it will humble you and bring you back to um, the ground, especially if you're running off of your negative thoughts or feeling like you're stressing out about a situation that you might be anticipating in the day. Um, so just give thanks for all the amazing things and you'll start to see them come back to you tenfold. So I hope you have enjoyed this video and if you did then please like, comment and subscribe and until next time please keep spreading the positive vibes and love and I will see you soon. Mwah.